Yahoo, 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 yahoo. What is up, everyone? I am Super Ganky, and today I'm going to be talking to you about the best free game on Steam called King of Crabs. Get Ganky. This is my most recent round. I just died as the King of Crabs over 1 million points, 112 trophies for all my kills, 47 deaths. That's serious, but let's get into the video. This is a battle royale game and you're fighting against real people. Other people out there want to be the King Crabs, but you got to want it. You got to have the discipline. You got to have the motivation, put in the time, the effort, the work to become the King Crabs. Let's hop into the video, get Genki. Right here, this is where we're going to look at the King of Crabs. That's the game name. My name is Mr. Fernand Mondeco. So if you wish to play this game, come visit me up. I am, let me tell you what I am. I am a crab champion and i'm about to be a crab king today we're going to be on that grind get that crab king medal but there's a, a lot of grinding to do here this is about 50 hours of gameplay everyone starts as an unranked and then all of a sudden you get more points you kill more crabs you play more you become a bronze and then you become a bronze two bronze three then you're silver one silver two silver three so there are three rankings to each tier of crab right and you see all these check marks they give you presents along the way now, what are the presents like? Let me show you what some of the presents are, right? So we're going to win prizes, right? This is our crab grab em game. So we have regular points and then we have pearls. Now, pearls are going to give you better draws from the crab machine. Now, what I'm going to show you in this video is what it's like to get both. So let's play the regular. And keep in mind that I'm a crab champion right now. So a lot of the, the normal prizes I would get are different because I have a lot of the upgrades already. So we got one for our giant mud crab. We were just playing as a giant mud crab. We have one for our hermit crab. I don't like hermit crabs. We got two for our giant mud crab. Get Genki! And we got a fast growth. Now, they give you some in-game boosts. A fast growth is an in-game boost, which allows you to grow faster, right? You always want to check here, though, at the promo bundles, because usually they have deals where you can get cool stuff for less pearls. Now, Usually the only thing that I would ever get in the promo bundles is the Play Royale grabs. Now I'm going to show you what it's like to have one of these Play Royale, Play Royale grabs right now. So let's click it. Ready? Let's go. Let's see what we win. Let's see what we win. Bam. Got a Stone Crab. Stone Crabs are good crabs. We got a Fire Chief Helmet level 4. 250 damage to our Fireman's Axe. We were using one of those in the last video. We got a Pizza Hat. Level five, growth from food, 25%, get Genki. Another pizza hat for no reason, ooh. A chef hat, level five, butcher knife damage, 300%. Two giant mud crabs, ooh, nice. Three Atlantic lobsters, but I don't like Atlantic lobsters at all. Um, double XP, that's really important, especially for when you're grinding early on in the game. Double XP gives you a really, really good edge when you're playing. What you got to learn about this game is you got to learn the abilities of all these crabs. You see, I've been playing for a long time, so all of my stuff is maxed out. Something that I didn't know when I started playing was this special move, how to do it. You press E to use your special move because there's no tutorial to teach you how to do this stuff. You're going to have to learn through the grind, but I want to help you get better as soon as possible so you can join me, Fernand Mondego, at the top of the the leaderboards because we can be friends in this game we can be buddies you can join me you can be number two i can be number one that's how we play the king of crabs all day every day get genki best free game on steam you're gonna start off with your brown crab the next crab you're gonna get is a rainbow crab now after the rainbow crab you're gonna get a blue crab blue crabs are really good too i had a lot of fun with the blue crab when i was a low level crab master midden crabs are underrated but they're actually one of the strongest crabs in the game because of their special move Always be aware of what the special moves for each crab is because it'll make or break the game. But midden crabs, let me tell you this. I've been king of crabs with midden crabs a lot because they have a really, really high attack damage spec. Then you get a spanner crab. Spanner crabs are really good for disengagement. You see, you burrow somewhere, you go, burrow, you go rise up somewhere else. Stone crabs, I've also been the king of crabs a lot with this crab because it has a really good shield to be able to block people with. We just upgraded it to the max. So now we're maxed out on all of our stone crab. Get ganky. Elbow crabs is really good crab for attack damage because they have the spin around attack that does circular damage and also protects you a little bit. Hermit crabs, not my thing. It could be your thing, not my thing. It's a good defensive crab, but it's really hard to get away um, if the person is going to keep attacking you. And it's not good for offense, you know what I mean? Giant mud crab, this was the crab that I just used. Super bomb crab, and we're just going to upgrade it five points right now. 
Bam, Gen Genki, we're so close to max upgrade with this. Snow crabs, snow crabs are another good offensive crab. A little harder to get used to, but we'll talk about the crabs individually later on in other tutorials and I'll teach you how to use them all. And then we have our Atlantic Lobster, which was I was really disappointed in. I didn't like the Atlantic Lobster at all. It's very hard to get this crab leveled up. Now, now that you have your crab basis down, you have to know about your quests. This is another thing, because if you complete all the quests and what they say, you're going to get a Royal Grab. And getting Royal Grabs is really important because Royal Grabs are far better than Normal Grabs. I'm going to do another Normal Grab for you to see because I have the coins right now. And probably we can do another Royal Grab. But um, yeah, Giant Mud Crab, nice. Atlantic Lobster, yeah, it's whatever. You'll look at different things. You'll see different things when you do these grabs because you'll be able to unlock all these things. Like, I think that usually speaking, you can unlock all of these crabs up to level, you can unlock 10 crabs in the grabs and then all these other crabs have to be earned by rank. That's what I've experienced so far. I'll be making more videos to teach you how to play this game later. Come join me. Let's make the Super Genki Army of Fernand Mondego, the Count Mondego. I had a lot of fun making this video. If you like this video, I'm here to smash this like button. Give King of Crabs a try on man. Robot Squid, a great game. I'll see you in the next one, everyone. Peace out.